Hi everybody, this is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com. Today I'm going to be talking about how to convert a Microsoft Excel document into Google Sheets format using Google Drive. It's a bit of a mouthful, but you'll see why it makes sense in a little bit. And disclaimer, what you're going to see here may look a little bit different for you, depending on when you watch the video and maybe how you have your Google account set up and you're responsible for following any relevant terms and conditions. So let's get started. And we're going to get started actually in Google Drive. Uh, don't do this directly in Google Sheets. And the reason why, if you use Google Sheets to directly upload a Microsoft Excel document, it will automatically convert it for you whether or not you want to convert it. And that's important, for instance, if you want to keep the original copy of the Microsoft Excel document in Google Drive, or you want to try limited editing of the Microsoft Excel document in Google, Google Sheets, which is possible. I'll show you show that to you in a minute. So here's where we get started. Google Drive, you need a Google account. I strongly recommend using the Google Chrome browser, uh, whether you're using Windows or a Mac. Of course, if you're using a Chromebook, Google Chrome is the only browser you can use. And the reason is, is because Google optimizes all of its software, such as Google Docs, Google Sheets, Google Drive for Google Chrome. So go to New, File Upload, and then find the file that you're looking for. Okay, so I know what I'm looking for. I'm just gonna paste it in here. This is an old sales document, nothing sensitive here. So Google Drive just uploaded the document. And if I click on it right now, what it's gonna do is it's going to open up this Excel document, which is denoted by the little green X, into Google Sheets. So it uses a Chrome extension to do that. I think it's called Office Editing for uh, Microsoft for for uh, for Google Drive or something like that. Um, if you have a Chromebook, it will automatically do this. So, anyways, what this is doing is it's letting me make it, this is the original Excel document. You can see from the name too, and it lets me make simple edits. Like I can do things like I could change the text here. I can manually type in a formula, and it will it may be able to complete the formula, but it's not very fully featured. And you can see just by looking at the toolbar at the top, there's almost nothing here. Most of it's related to formatting, not to doing uh, Excel, you know, math functions or anything like that. So I really do need to convert it to Google Sheets. Easy to do. Go to File, Save as Google Sheets. So it's opening it up in Google Sheets. It looks exactly the same, but there's a few differences. One is at the top, well, first of all, this might show you this goofy message, like, hey, your file is now in Google Sheets. Um, and you can share it and do stuff like that. But in the upper left corner, you'll see this icon. It's a green uh, Sheets home icon. It won't show the X like it would if it were a uh, micro, still in Microsoft Excel format. And then also you'll see a full featured toolbar here. This is the normal Google Sheets toolbar. There's more here. So I can do things like auto sum or, and plus all these other formulas here. I can do things like uh, create a chart, insert a chart, and so that's really useful if you want to quickly do some work and maybe, for instance, you don't have Microsoft Excel or you just want to do it in Google Sheets for whatever reason. One last thing I want to show you, um, in Google Drive, it's also possible to do a conversion of the document. And let's, I'll show you what I mean. So I'm going to X out of these. Uh, basically, find the document. So uh, here's the XLS document. Click it once. Just select it. Don't open it. Then go to the More Actions and open with... Google Sheets, and the same thing will happen. It will open it up in Google Sheets uh, and convert it at the same time. For more information on how to get the most out of Google Drive, Docs, Sheets, Slides, I've written a book about it. This is actually on the third edition right now. You can get it from in30minutes.com. If this video helped you, please take a moment to like it or follow me on YouTube, and you can also see more of my videos and blog posts about everything Google at in30minutes.com. Thank you so much for watching.